everybody, it's December 3rd and I am vlogmasing tonight. I uploaded a bonus earlier. Oh, here comes Mallory. Mallory, you want to come um, be in the vlog? Do you want to vlog with me? She doesn't want to. But she does want some of my candy cane. These are the candy canes I got from um, a Dollar Tree. And they're those things that they're like air puffed. You know, they, they, they melt, like melt away or something. They're so good. So anyhow... I got my cards here. Gonna shuffle. Shuffle, shuffle. Alright, I'm gonna pick one. This one here. Alrighty, so let's see. Describe a Christmas that at the time seemed to suck. But as a grown up, you realize actually rocked. Okay. Oh, I love my questions. Alright. So, I was nine years old, and the whole family for Christmas that year flew to um, Elko, Nevada to see my grandparents. That's where they lived, my, mom, my dad's mom and dad. And it took every, literally every dime my mom and dad had to get us to Elko, from Central California to Elko, Nevada. And so, you know, when we get there a few days before Christmas, they didn't have, really have any money left over to do any presents. So... Um, on Christmas Day, we had, I had a little tiny pile, this itty bitty little pile, about this high of Christmas, right? It was a candy cane, a skein of brown yarn, and a crochet hook, and a pair of nylons, my very first pair of nylons. Okay, three things, right? They might have spent five bucks on me, but it was the first time I ever had my own nylons, and... My grandmother, with that yarn and that crochet hook, taught me how to crochet, which I've been doing ever since I was nine. Now, I remember at the time being kind of bummed because, you know, you didn't have a lot of things to open. In fact, that, <coughs> I'm going to choke on my candy cane. <laughs> anyway, see, this is what happens to fat people. <laughs> Anyhow, it wasn't even wrapped, right? It was just a little pile, this sad little pile of cheap crap from the five and dime. And I was I was a little perturbed, but the rest of that the rest of that um, holiday was awesome because it um, it snows there. I mean sometimes piles piles up, and it had snowed the day of Christmas, the night the Christmas Eve, and in the morning there was this thick pile of powdery, sugary, gorgeous snow. And we went out and we played all day. Um, and it was sunny, too, that day. It was just, it was magical. And coming from a place that it, where it doesn't snow, uh, it was really cool to have a, a white Christmas. So that Christmas, the Christmas I was nine, seemed to suck. But when I look back on it, I realize how much fun I had and how, you know, super cool it was to spend it with my grandparents, too. Um, I... I was closer probably to that grandmother than anybody else except for my mom. I mean, she was really formative in my life. And, um, yeah, so that was the Christmas, my ninth Christmas, the Christmas of the nylons. Uh, I'm really loving doing these. If you guys can come up with any um, questions that you want me to answer, just send them, and I'll, um, I'll, I'll, I'll answer them. I won't pick them out. I'll just answer them. Because I only got, I don't know, four or five or six um, suggestion. Well, maybe 10 suggestions from people and the rest I wrote myself. So anyway, I hope you're all having a great early December and all is well and happy and all of that stuff in your life. And I think I'm going to go back to eating this because, you know, that's what I like to do best. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.